heard um, helicopters and which is what got our attention. This weekend, a major scene played out in a usually quiet part of North Scottsdale. A manhunt Sunday night into Monday morning led to three more arrests in the ongoing South American theft group burglary series. And the guy was hiding out and where was he hiding and, you know, gee, should we have the lights on or turn the lights off? Scottsdale police searched communities around Pima and Joe Max after reports of burglaries and suspicious activity. A lot was racing through neighbors' minds during the massive police presence of patrol officers, detectives, drones and helicopters. It is scary and people, I think, are more and more scared about it. And, you know, we have burglar alarms in our homes, but I'm not sure how much good they're doing. Investigators say the three people they caught, a woman, a man, and a teenage boy, are all from Chile. They say this crew is connected to the crime ring that's linked to nearly 150 so-called dinnertime burglaries across the valley. It is very unnerving when you think it's right next door. Police believe there are many more suspects out there continuing to operate all over Phoenix and the country. Scottsdale Police Chief Jeff Walther says these alleged criminals are here legally through a visa waiver program. These are not uh, some of our homegrown burglars that are that are breaking into residence to to feed a, a possible addiction. Uh, but th these are these are professionals. I, I mean, I've been to Chile and, and, and I, I thought it was kind of a neat place to be. But so I, I don't want to blame those people. But then again, I mean, there's, it's a crime wave and crime, crime is everywhere. Michaela Marshall for Arizona's family. Michaela, thanks very much. A bit more on this.